Back to the recording. Back to 71,000 souls. Once I learned to absolutely rush the boss, I was having a better time with the boss. There was a lot of stand around and wait, but it gave me time to prep my soul mass and then get going. Oh, hello. Then let us as. Alright. That'll do it. That should help you on your journey. May we meet again? I hope so, buddy. Oh, hello. Then let as prop. It's not that I'm concerned. Even if. Note that. Well. I've already bought soul. The sorcerer kettles. Goodbye, then. Do stay. All the best, pal. You were a good help. I did have options. It does sweeping. Alright. So then, Griggs might be gone now. No, he's not. Oh, hello. Then, as. Oh, maybe I have to, like, zone or something. Let's just buy another one. Alright. That should. May we. I'm gonna be flexible with your equipment, yeah. I read that as PvP and I was about to like say things. Okay. Like I made it work so obviously I wasn't built screwed. Built build screwed. That didn't sound good no matter how I said it. Hi, I'm great. Go ahead, even now. Two and amaze and bash the other guy's face in. God, what even would I want to do at this point? Nothing gives poise. Um. Exclusive by armor. Okay, fair enough. I like the idea of beating this game at level nice. But I really need to dump these souls. Well, you we're still here. Oh, hello. Then, as pro. Goodbye, then. Deuce. You're the pirate frame fool. <laughs> I bought everything from Logan because I have his catalyst. I have also killed Logan. Also, yeah, I have WDB, so. Last time I talked to him in the shop menu, he said uh, he was like it, he wanted to learn from Logan or something. Well, uh, you need it. Let's prepare. Doesn't have a Lord Vessel Gate. Wow. Doesn't surprise me. I'll just throw a bit. As fun as it would be to beat the game at level nice, let's just get more of it. Locking it in. Those are probably like 
a super kindle, this thing's gonna be like probably my closest bonfire. Oh, so yeah. oh, then as it's not that I'm concerned for even in no the well. It's not that I'm concerned even no well. It's not that I'm concerned even no well. Alright. Actually, may we Okay. Yeah, he's just here. He, he he doesn't have any sorceries to give me, but he's still here. That's fine. It's already past noon. Get your life together. No, no, I'm fine. I'm fine. Well and wide awake. Not treat me like an old withering snake. Strat to be the king's earliest to grab a sword length, Zvank, Claymore, Gravelord Sword, Stone Armor from the Forest, poise through their melee attacks. Wow. Okay, let's take another vitality, I guess. This endurance gives stamina. What oh, does? Like three kings that way, nice. Okay. Kagiyama, what is up, Halo? How are you doing? I am pleased. Is it the beings who had them? Very well. Then stay still for a moment. He's how you sell stuff in this game. You feed him items and he gives you souls. No one my Kristen Roblox server yet. Kill going to be dumped straight in a new game plus. Okay. If I had ways of copying my save file, then that would be different. You are not aggro because I can't target you. Oh, you're not even real, okay. <sighs> Kiln of the first flame. Hoo boy. It's chillin', they walkin'. Oh my god, <laughs> this place is gorgeous! It would be Silver Knights. Silver. Well, they behave like it. <laughs> Ow. I got distracted. You really like the stabby attack. Yeah, they're, they're, they're silver knights. They're, they're, they may as freaking well be. I don't care that they're not silver. 
They're silver knights. attack or something. That isn't that one. And because Dark Souls, yeah. Those are silver knights. Tight night jungle. Ooh, nice. So freaking the queen's pot, right? So I don't suppose there's a way to like copy my save so I can go beat the game and do DLC after, right? That's a problem. <laughs> Okay, I can, in fact, back up my save. Okay. Cool. Because I just started recording. I, I, w I didn't see the chat message. I asked the question before I caught up on chat. So in theory, how would I go about doing that? <laughs> I can copy the physical file, okay. Also, very much assuming I can just roll off of there and die. Okay, so with all the souls, this takes me up to 20 anyway. Okay, cool. Documents and BGI. Really? Feels like it's as strange as usual. Okay. Okay, so let me exit out of the game. It's gonna be really weird. Because I want to go beat the game and then do the DLC. I don't want to, like, be stuck in DLC and then because like this feels like a really good like everything in me wants to beat this DLC like more than anything so <laughs> just embarrassing stuff toxels okay Dark Souls remastered Do I just like copy the whole folder? What? I'm folder with my GFW. Well, what? Oh, okay. Okay, so I have Dark Souls Remastered, some, like, I have Dark Souls, Dark Souls Remastered, and Numbers. And then I have more Numbers. And that has... A bunch of stuff. Well, not a bunch of stuff, like two files. Like a Steam Auto Cloud and a... Drax something or other. I'm thinking I just copy the whole Dark Souls Remastered thing out of my documents. And if that doesn't work, I cry when I don't do the DLC on New Game. Do 
Yeah, but what's the save file? I don't know. Like, there, there's... Okay, so... Dark Souls Remastered. Then I go into that folder, there is a, a folder with a bunch of numbers. And then in that folder, there's something.sl2 and Steam Auto Club. Games for Windows like, oh, that. Let's copy the whole of the NBGI folder. Okay. That makes more sense. I was kidding, but there we go. And then I replace it when I want to load after beating potentially the final boss, right? And if it messes up, it messes up. I'll have to like do another playthrough with the DLC some other time or something. I have a way to science it. Well, that would take a long time to science it. Copy back up to the Okay. Confirm that it works? Question mark? Like, have people, like, done this? Or is it just, like, a theory? A game theory? Thanks for playing. I've decided to keep this all in the recording. Okay. Do vitamins to other people. Oh, okay. <laughs> I like Link is Dead as a concept. Oh yeah, you can in fact roll off there and die. Well, we better find out. Ghost. This area is so pretty. God, it feels weird being in like the last area of the game. It feels so weird being at the end of Dark Souls after all this time. And yeah, there's stuff I didn't do, and yeah, there were some problems. I'm gonna like just immediately try and book it. I don't like Silver Knights. Silver, so they're not silver. I don't care, they're silver knights. I don't like them. Ow! There's gonna be a way to consistently get past that guy, I can feel it. I haven't done Painted World, no. And then down here, there's probably one more Silver Knight. Yep, I was right. Ooh, okay. Spear guy. Thank you. Holy Christ, you hit hard. Final boss, so you're supposed to be hard. Oh, the music though! That went about as well as expected. 
Okay. We're in for a time, friendos. Let's cement it. Yeah. Now I just have to get back there every single time. Keeping up with the story so far, right? More or less. I haven't been reading through all of the lore like a good bird. Just did it with remaster. Okay. Sweet. So that I can go do the DLC at a later time. If I beat this tonight, then I can take a filler week and move on afterwards. Dove, we want to see you do the DLC. I mean, a lot of people want to see me do the DLC. Character was that cool. I almost just ran off looking at chat, Lamau. Oh no, you're coming. I have escaped from Sword Guy. I hope they don't actually want me to fight all those guys every single time on the way down because no. I mean, there's only like four guys, but still, no. Let's try this again. Broke everything and keep power away from others. Absolute oligarchy. Hit point for a second. You're a difficult boss. Homeward bone after killing him. True. That's something I could do. I really don't want to fight the guys to get to him. I don't have to to get to Gwyn, so. He's the final boss. He's allowed to be as hard as he likes. I should grab an ending, yeah. Filler week might include the DLC. DLC might be recorded thing. I honestly don't know. Cross that bridge when we get to it. But if I can beat the game today, it would end the week on beating Dark Souls, which would be great. Really? Really? Sigh. Why do you have to? Why do you have to put enemies here? I'm not gonna parry Gwyn. I know you can. I'm not going to. If these guys stayed dead, I would fight them. But no. So.
because Gwen is a terrible person. Gameplay wise, not lore wise. I'm not asking the god of this world, I'm asking the devs. <laughs> They're Gwyn's Knights. I mean, fine, but like running back through them every single time is not fun. <laughs> the lore is all well and good. I am asking questions from the dev standpoint. Let's not do the lawyering thing, Brent, please, for the love of God. I know, I'm talking about a gameplay perspective, design gameplay choice, as per section rule part paragraph 32b. <laughs> gameplay design choice wise. Whew, that would have gotten me. You don't have a lot of health! I'm alive? Come on. Juggled. You don't have a lot of health, though. Win is a glass cannon. Absolutely. I'm not actually salty about it. What I'm salty about is people, like, you know, me idly musing, gosh, these enemies are kind of annoying to walk back through every single time, lol. And everyone going, but the lord! And I'm like, that's not what I said. Glass Cannon Final Bosses. That's fine by me. Glass Cannon Final Boss in this game? Fine with. If I learn how to dodge more than like twice, then I win. Okay, keep first man. He's an absolute husk of what he used to be. True Gwyn win. Go back in time, fight Gwyn. This is Gwyn Prime. Oh, okay, that's more consistent than trying to dodge through you. If I can learn to dodge this boss or god forbid parry it, I win. Like, th th this is just a straight up beat up, beat down kind of fight. I either win or I lose, there's no other way about it. But it's a fast fight. I'm actually dumb, okay. My idle musing did not need answers and justifications. It's Dark Souls. The run up to the boss has always had enemies in it. The enemies aren't even bad. I just don't like fighting them because I take a lot of damage on the way and it takes so much time. Like, imagine if I was fighting through these guys every single time just to get one shot by Gwyn. That wouldn't be fun. It would take about like five, ten minutes to fight through literally everything every time just to get one shot. I know what this boss is about. <laughs> I didn't realize he was that squishy. Didn't add much to the gameplay, but like Drake Lex said, product of its time, product of the region.
That guy's gonna get me one of these days. Actual dragons come out unscathed. That sounds like a JRPG hero. We're just, we're realistically just fighting a JRPG pro tag. Prime some to unlock that content. Wow. Damn it. Ah, okay. Okay, so I'm not even gonna bother with the homing soul mass. I'm just gonna go straight for soul spears. First place form during the war against the dragons to get Gwyn, Nido, Witch of Izalith, and Fear to Pygmy, strength to defeat the dragons. It was supposed to go out, but Quinn sacrificed himself to keep it going. You know, because he did, people can't die properly and everything's all kinds of messed up. Yep. Sounds about right. He's not hard to hit. I need to learn how to dodge, which I'm slowly getting better at. And I just need to not get hit so much. His attacks aren't that bad to read. I just need to get better at it. That was a good attempt. That was actually a good attempt. He's yeah, he's incredibly aggressive. That's fine. He doesn't have a lot of health, but like Correct choice when fighting a sorcerer. Oh yeah, absolutely. That that is my weakness. Be that aggressive, because I'm super squishy. Okay, I don't think steel protection is gonna help me out that much, but I'm gonna try. I'm not gonna try it. I meant to roll. I was in menu though. Well. Okay, screw it. <laughs> We're just gonna give this another attempt. Ooh, okay, there, there's a timing to it.
I dodged late, but it still didn't punish me for it. Ooh, nice lucky. Unfortunate. All right. Unfortunate. I healed through his grab attack. I did. Yeah. Double kill would have been hilarious. One more CSS would have sent him. Yeah. If I had. I, I should have gone for it. How bad is my... Fine, okay. I'm close to being the Dark Soul, yep. Probably just exploded. It's probably insta-kill, oh yeah. It's don't get hit by it. Oh wait, something else I wanted to do. Um, I just need my shield at this point. One more secret for Gwen. I'm alright. I don't want any tips. That was dodgy. I almost didn't dodge that. So it means I'm gonna have to, like, be more, like, good with stuff. Yeah, no, no, fake tips. Is the fake tip don't die? Sake. This isn't help at all.
I can't just like... I just like can't get, like I'm taking that opening hit and I just can't get back. Take care, Brian. Thanks for hanging out. Appreciate it. Okay, so how about I use these in the meantime? Just like maybe get around that a little bit better. There are ways to recover, but like god, there are just no openings. So in that case, like the, the physical ring did nothing for me. I didn't do what I thought it was going to do. I mean, yeah, it's smart of him not to let his opponent recover, and the final boss, like, not giving you a moment to breathe is whatever, really. He was once. Slow, or I was fast enough, I was too slow. Humanity was created by creation, dark finding souls created by the first flame. Yeah. I'm just gonna leave with C. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna lead with CSS, so hold up. need to get around him and if I can get a minute to breathe and like learn how to recover if I can learn how to recover I'm fine I wish these guys stayed dead though because then I would actually have a reason to fight them but I have no reason to fight them there is literally no reason I gain nothing Legitimately zero reason on this planet to ever fight those guys. <laughs> they are the most pointless enemies in existence.
was ready for that. I was dumb. Damn it! Ah, I won it again! Ah. It's not anger, it's just exasperation. It's not anger though. Like, New Londa was bad, this is fun. It's a genuinely fun but extremely difficult fight. But it's fair. It's hard, but it's fair. It's- it's not a bad boss. This is a very, very, very good boss. Very good. I hate the run-up. How long it is with, like, these enemies that I didn't like in Anor Londo. It wouldn't be a final boss. Yeah, this is the final boss. It's allowed to be hard. It's allowed to be hard for the reasons that it is. You Evan is not a final boss, correct. Ooh, that was just very bad. I should have healed when I had the chance. No, I don't. That button, I was pressing it. Sometimes in this game, it's extremely rare, but sometimes in this game, you're just staggered as if you are stunned, and no amount of input is going to register for any length of time. It's happened to me a total of three times, that being one of them, but... My problem with this boss is how long it takes between attempts. 
for how much you just die. And forget the enemies part. If you had to fight the enemies every time, this would be garbage. Oh, I'm dead. Just kill me. Here, just kill me. Because better than trying to recover. Like, I was mashing the dodge roll button, and I was there for like a solid two seconds. And nothing happened. <laughs> I don't want to kill these guys. Fighting them takes way too long. It already takes way too long on an empty run to get back to Gwyn. Oh boy, let's retrieve my nothing. Actually asking, there. This really is the run up every single time. There's no secret bonfire if you fight everybody, right? Like I know it's a dumb question, but yeah, is the run up okay? No bonfire. Okay, fair enough. That should have hit me. I'm okay that it didn't, but like, that should have. If I recognize that attack, I should just go. attack is so weird. Healing in his face is not the best idea. Oh, goodbye. I die. Yeah, you just explode. I want to hack in a bonfire before this guy, because it's impossible to practice. Just because, like, let me get a timer going. I have a stopwatch. Like, I get it, it's the final boss. The final boss is allowed to be hard, but... It's way more than one minute. Keep in mind, I'm dead sprinting the whole time and not fighting anything.
I know, I got hit by the easiest telegraphed attack in the world. We all learned something today. never uses it. He uses it a lot with me so far. So about a minute 45 each attempt. It's not that bad then. Dodge the ready for I'm an idiot! Oh my god. A minute 45 every single attempt and I cannot recover after the first attack which is hard to dodge. Cause like I panicked and forgot my buttons is what happened. So that was, like, every single death has been my fault, except for the literal one where it was, like, mashing dodge roll and nothing was happening for two full legitimate seconds. But aside that one, every single other death has been my fault, which is why this is okay. It's just the run-up to die instantly. Piano tune on a recorder, yep. Ooh, that was luck. I dodged wrong. Dodge this attack! Why can I not dodge this attack? Why can I not- That attack is so hard to dodge! Time to waste another two minutes. Actually, wait, hold up. Can I, like... Okay, since you already mentioned it before I even said anything, what shield do I have that's better for Gwen? Dragon Crest, okay, I had a feeling. Oh, it's still 100% physical, so that's good. No, 
Oh, I'm still mid? Okay. By how much? Barely. Heck. Um, oh, I don't have the souls, whatever. theory do I need to level up? I have Titanite chunks. I can make my lightning rapier stronger. That's cool. while I'm at it. I don't want to be left uh, without any kind of attack if I run out. I've abandoned the rapier in favor of pure sorceries at this point. a very lucky dodge on my part. I don't think hitting him with the staff is going to do any actual measurable meaningful damage.
Ooh, okay. A lot, a lot more helpful. Okay, I can take like another hit or so. And my shield is no longer useless. That helps. But I have to get very consistent at dodging that opening attack or I just lose. Getting hit by any of the knights beforehand is a loss. Well, I can heal right before the fight starts, I guess. Or, like, right after I get in the gate, but, like... Those guys stop chasing me? No, they didn't. Okay. They did for a second. How I dodge that. Yeah, I knew it was a bad idea. 
I like this boss, I really do. I just hate the two minutes in between attempt to die instantly, two minutes. Like, it didn't have to be so long. I don't care about the enemies at this point, they're not hard to dodge, just how long it takes to get back. I am dead sprinting the entire time. It would probably take two and a half minutes if I was just normal running. And like 10 if I fought everything. Black Knight Halberd, be nice. I know I can, I just have to get there. I just have to, like, get the good attempt. It's not even bad design, I'm just, like, not a fan of. Because this is exactly my kind of difficulty. Really short boss that's, like, really hard. Really short, fast difficulty. I, this is really my kind of thing. I just... This long stretch of literal nothing. <laughs> Did I just stagger him? Okay. That was stupid. I'm dead. Stupid, I'm dead.
Why did I do that? Why did I do that? Why did I do that? I wasn't looking at his health at all that entire fight. Oh my god. <laughs> ah! And before those knights come in, it's just to murder me. Leave and let it go out. So, not looking at the health bar in a in a Soulsborne boss is the greatest thing. You don't want to know how close you are to victory, ever. Oh my god. Oh my god, give me a second. Oh my god. Oh. I had one crystal soul mass left. I had my soul arrows, but let's be honest, those were not gonna help. 11 flasks. Oh my god. He was being really generous jumping back a lot and not, like, punishing me for healing a lot. I know I have a choice to make. I know I do. <laughs> Actually asking, by leaving and letting the flame go out, is it, it's just walking away, right? Or do I have to hit the thing to get the choice? Just walk away. Oh my god, I don't know what choice to make. <laughs> just walk away from the room. Oh my god. Uh. Yeah, okay. So let it go. I did not hit the link to prompt. Okay. Because I'm planning to do the DLC. Yeah. Oh my god. That was such a good boss. That is such a good boss. It is hard as hell. But Gwyn is a fair boss. And really satisfying when you win. Then you did a fire, let it die. <laughs> I don't know. You realize I'm probably gonna flip a coin, right? <laughs> 
I'm leaning one way specifically, but like, oh my god. <laughs> uh, I have technically beaten the Dark Souls. Uh, your vote is to let the fire go out. I'm not going to take anyone else's suggestion. I'm going to do what I'm going to do. Whether it goes out or not is going to be because it's what I choose. Holy hell. Dark Mage Dove. That is the hardest boss I have fought in a single player game that was any kind of satisfying in an extremely long time. I scream like that when I clear a savage fight in 14 for the first time. When I clear an MMO raid tier, that's about the level of scream I give off. And two options. Both have votes on it. Well, like I said, there, I don't care who votes for what. A thousand people could raid me right now saying Link the Fire and I might walk away. Ugh. That was about the volume of scream I gave off when I cleared P4S for the first time. <laughs> Very, 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 very satisfying fight. Very good fight. I'll give my final thoughts after I pick an ending. I picked an ending. This was intentional. Let the Age of Fire continue for all time. Until Dark Souls 3, anyway. He's over in phone. I thought about it. I thought about closing the game, too. Oh my god, okay. Ugh. So there's a reason I wanted to beat the game tonight more than anything else. It wasn't to like end it on a stream week or whatever. That was part of it. Part of it was this technically allows me to play Bloodborne and Elden Ring. Bad ending achieved. Yep. I had a feeling as much. I knew enough about the lore to know that that was not a good thing, but that was the decision. I mean. Oh my god, what a game. D Dark Souls is an amazing game. No, I have not played Metroid Dread. I don't even own it. It Literally, the reason I didn't get Metroid Dread is money. I don't have the money to get Metroid Dread right now. I want to very much, but... So this game is a top five tier game. Oh, no interpretation whether they made the right choice or not, yeah. Perpetuating a cycle versus breaking it. Literal gray versus gray morality choice. In this crap sack world, I think letting the flame go out would have been better. Inspired by Dark Souls. I love this game. I love this genre. I love the difficulty of this game. I think the difficulty of this game is overblown and overrated. By, like, a lot. It's a difficult game. It's a punishing game. But to be perfectly honest, I believe this game's difficulty is completely overblown. By that, I mean any game that has difficulty in it is The Dark Souls of X. This game is very good. And it is difficult. 
but it's not the hardest game I've ever played. Not even close. Well, okay, it's pretty close. But it's not the hardest game I've ever played. <laughs> it's it's perfect. This game, with the exception of New Londo Runes, is perfectly fair. About 95% of my deaths were my fault as a player. Everything came down to I made this mistake and the game punished me for it. So I learned to get better. That's what Dark Souls is. I will go back and do the DLC, don't get me wrong. But, like, having beaten my first proper Soulsborne game, I'm extremely satisfied. That final boss was a very satisfying conclusion to a very satisfying game. Top 5 tier. Easy. My official rating. I don't- so for people that are new to this stream or new to my community, I don't rate things on a scale of 1 to 10 or 1 to 5. I don't necessarily rank my games except FF14 at the top, followed by FF6 and Chrono Cross. I rate things based on top 5 tier, top 10 tier. Top 5 tier is, I love this game. Top 10 tier is, I really like this game. And then, I don't really go beyond that. If I give something an X out of 10, it means it probably didn't make top 10 tier. <laughs> Unless it's like, oh wow, this game is like a 9.8 out of 10. A series about awareness, learning, and adapting your strategy to overcome challenges. Yes. Dropping my rapiers at the very end to just magic Gwyn was part of that. Because that was the thing that was working for me consistently. Like, I wasn't going to get stabs off on Gwyn. I wasn't going to get the stabby stabs on Gwyn. Let's be honest. Ugh, top 5 tier game. Very, 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 very good game. And it, j it just jumps you back in a new game plus, I see. No, 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 no. Again, this is going to sheer disrespect. Yes, indeed. The dark sign brands the undead. And in this land, the undead are corralled and led to the north. Huh. <sighs> Where they are locked away. You have 40 decks and you have fireballs faster than you can recover from them. Wow. The He's weak to fire, that feels mean. I thought I wasn't hollow for a second there. <coughs> faith build. Is Gwyn rough with faith? Hilariously resistant to lightning, fantastic. Okay, so for anything not DLC related, it's all on the table.
<laughs> yeah, fair enough. <clears throat> Good luck. Oh, wow, why did I do that? Yeah, huh. Let's... Perfect spot difficulty-wise. No sides you have to level to survive. Enemies aren't made of sponge. Yeah. Demon's Great Hammer. Get away! It's more HP than KP. Jesus! Okay. Yeah, this is a very good introduction to the series. <clears throat> this is a very good game. It's kind of full stop. Are you gonna lock me in? Look like. There is literally only one part of this game I don't like. Everyone knows what that part is by now. Oh, thank the Van Dark Oh God, I wish regrettably, but, but there was an Oh, when that one that one oh now I Big was Pilgrim's Key. Didn't check a lot of the gear I picked up. That's true. I was never going to replace the chest piece. And I was never going to replace the hat unless there was a cooler looking hat. Like a demon in your lost eyes. Bed of Chaos, I, I recognize. Full stop that it was luck. That made that not as bad. I got very, very lucky. Yo, plunge! Thank you for the raid. Is that straight demon I hear under there? I'm gonna sign something. Snared Pirates, what is up? Hello, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Plunge, thank you so much for the raid. Okay, let me get to this, and then... Okay. Alright, welcome everyone from Plunge. So can I get a follow command for Plunge87, please, and thank you. My name is Dove. I am an analytical variety streamer. Heavy lean on RPGs and or retro games. Of course, by analytical I mean deep dying into a game's plot or lore. I did not do a good job of it this game. Uh, coming up what if scenarios, uh, stuff like that. Um, alternately, I dig into games mechanics through things like challenge runs and randomizers, ROM hacks, mods, that sort of thing. So if uh, any of that stuff floats your boat, you like Final Fantasy or just like RPGs, retro games in general, just feel free to hit the follow button, come back again sometime. 
blue slab in the crystal cave. So I did. Okay. Um, I just beat Dark Souls. And technically I'm on New Game Plus. But I'm not necessarily keeping the save because I want to do the DLC and not on New Game Plus. So... that I miss. Yeah, it's all on the table now. Yeah, the elevator just does not exist here at this exact second in time. Fantastic. Let's say Ray didn't do anything else. She's dead. He just kills her. Oh, I see. Well, every time I talked to her, she didn't mention anything about going back or doing anything else. Yeah, I'm okay with that stuff. Anything that is not related to the DLC is fine. I'm gonna perish. Oh, okay. So you then have to go to Paris, like, immediately, I'm assuming. Where the Firekeeper still- okay, I actually remember where that was. I'm gonna replace the save file and do the DLC at some point, probably soon. Here we are. That looks like death. It's probably death. Super like gonna have to leave on Lurk. No worries, no worries. Enjoy your Lurk. I'm not too far from being done myself, to be honest. It's not. Okay. Oh, so it isn't. And digs archives where she saw and ineffectively tries to kill you. Okay. That's depressing. So then she basically is. She doesn't have a good ending no matter what, then. Okay. Ah, uh, Absolutely great game. Very, very good video game. I love this game quite a bit. Unironically, thanks from Soft. This is a hard game. Okay, so I said this like right before the credits. But like the difficulty of this game is like completely overblown. I don't think this is like the hardest game in the universe. It's an ARPG that is very punishing and unforgiving and requires you to not just mash a button to attack forever and ever and ever and ever and hey I win. You actually have to strategize. You have to plan around your stamina, your attacks, boss patterns, boss openings. If you have any kind of analytical mindset, this game is an absolute joy. Like the synapses in my brain firing constantly whenever I'm in a boss fight because I'm trying to figure out how, when the best time to go for hit? What type of hit? Is this a magic boss? Is this a stabby boss? Like, all of that stuff is, you know, it's not by reason murder peaches and she'll be okay. I mean, true. This is Petrus. Goes hollow, yeah. I mean, that makes sense. That's the name of the game. Fight that 
lords. You damn fool. Enough of you. Feel the wrath of the gods. Never finished up with Sigma. I failed to save Solar. I didn't know that was an option. The games aren't hard. Grown up Mega Man style games are played. I want to be the guy fan games. Yeah. Now I want to be the guy fan games are usually blatantly unfair. But sometimes they're not. They're just very, very precision platforming, but different game entirely. Wait, what? Was it about the DLC? Genocide run. Yeah, did not it, it? Oh, is it possible to kill the bird up there or no? That one should remain secret. Okay. Boshi 10. Hell no. I only play good games on stream. Oh, but it was a cool secret. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. Solaris in DLC? Very specifically, the only thing I'm dodging at this point is, um, DLC stuff. If it doesn't involve the DLC, it's fair game at this point. See. Okay. I mean, I think I'll still avoid it. I'll just do judgment, but yeah. So I'm gonna, like, before I stop the recording, any last minute things people want to say before I swap save files again and this recording and this video project TM asterisk. Good night, Chaos. Thanks for hanging out. Appreciate it as always. I'm playing and falling with them. This game is great. I was expecting. So, like, with the reputation this game has, my very first time playing it, I was expecting it to be a lot more unfair. I was expecting kind of an I want to be the guy style. Whoops, this is a trap. <laughs> I was here. Fair enough, that's his valid. The beardy man, yeah. I adore this game. This game is absolutely brilliant. While I was playing it this time around, I was looking forward to every single stream where it's like, I get to play Dark Souls again. Because this game is fun. It's really hard. It's terrifying in some places when you don't know what's going on. But it's fair. Like, a majority of my deaths were my fault. It's 2011-12 place to... Yeah. Like, I saw this pattern in the floor. I'm like, that's gonna open up and kill me. Here's a box here. It's probably a mimic.
name the game of the year doesn't prepare to die edition. I mean, that's accurate though. You die a lot. That's how video games work. It's how difficult games work. You you learn. You die. You learn. You you die less the next time. Hopefully, maybe. I didn't go to Upper Blight Town this playthrough. No. Secret area in Blight Town. Yeah. Necessary. Explore that, yeah. Oh no, I know I planned on it. I had no con I had no intention of like continuing this new game plus. I'm screwing around and hitting buttons. Entry obviously to what is it, illusory wall. Oh, okay. Yeah, that was the thing I uh, like I was gonna go back to lower blight down and um Explore all that. Cause I yeah, there was a tree that I was going to when I was like, oh, is that where the boss is? And people were like, no, it's the other way. And I'm like, oh, okay. And then I forgot until like today and I made a point of it, but then I was like at the end of the game, so I'm like, I wanna beat this game first. <laughs> I wanted to beat the game before I did like anything else. So Even as frustrating and unfun as I had with New Londo Ruins, it it wasn't bad enough to completely mar the entire game. Once I figured out how to start the boss fight with the quote unquote four kings, and once I was like more consistently getting to the boss by just hot footing it. Hot foot it's smoky. Once I was like doing that, it was like a lot more bearable. So like, yeah, New Londo Runes is still my least favorite area in the game by a lot. Lost Isolith as an area is fine. Bed of Chaos was pure luck, and I refuse to hate it because of that. I retire in greatness. I'm like a soul short. Okay. So that was like the main game of Dark Souls. I'm gonna bring my save file back now, but in terms of like the video project, this is the end of the Dark Souls for now. I'm gonna do the DLC at some point, probably very soon. Um, but as for like just hecking around with the game in terms of a main game project, it's still gonna be main game until like, you know, for a little bit, but this is the end of it for now. I'm very satisfied. I have unlocked the ability to play Elden Ring in, Blood in Bloodborne, yeah. Um, yeah.